Good evening everyone. It is almost 11 o'clock on a Sunday night and I am just going to do a quick tutorial on how to do the knockout text effect within Cricut Design Space. I had a few requests for this. Um, it's kind of hard to explain if you're not familiar with what it is so I figured I'd do a video to help explain it but what it basically is is you're taking a part of the text color out and adding like an image in to create that effect. Like I said, it's a lot easier to explain once I have it done. Um, so I am going to go ahead and show you. So you're going to type whatever you want within the text. Sorry, I have a hard time talking and typing at the same time. So I already spelled that wrong. <laughs> there we go. I'm going to do April showers bring May flowers. And you can make it whatever size you want. I'm gonna go with that. Don't forget, you can always um, click this unlock button to unlock it, and that way you can bring it up or over or however you would like. April showers bring me flowers. Not sure why I thought of this, especially because it's winter and snowy where I am right now. But I don't know, maybe I'm craving spring, who knows. So anyways, that is my text that I'm going to be using. So I'm going to select all and weld it together. There we go. And then you're going to choose the image that you want. So I'm going to go into images and I'm going to want an umbrella. There we go. Let's find an umbrella. And when you do this project, you can only, well actually for anything, you can only slice two layers. Um, into a slice, so you're going to have to pick something that is a solid color. So, let's see, how about this? Um, and I have Cricut, um, or the Access Membership within Cricut Design Space, so any of the ones with an A right here are going to be free to use. I think it's about $100 a year, don't, don't quote me on that, but I think that's kind of about what it is. So let me go ahead and show you here. So I'm going to select all and oops, hang on. let's see. Actually, you're, you can just make your image here whatever size you want and whatever um, you know, whatever angle you want it. You can move it up, down, make it bigger, smaller. <clears throat> so once that's done, select all and you're going to slice it. There we go, and you're going to want to bring your sliced image all the way backwards. And then move this top layer out of the way. So now we have the knockout um, effect. So you can kind of see the umbrella around it. Um, I don't know if this was such a prime example to show you on, but ones that have words that are like super close together, the text that's super close together, um, you can see the knockout tech, or you can see the knockout effect a lot better with uh, image and stuff. But you can do this obviously with any any text, any photo you want. Silhouettes obviously work better because they're a solid image. But yeah, this is how you do it. Just thought I'd show you. Um, if you have any questions, please let me know, and I would love to answer them. Thanks for watching. Hope you all had a great weekend and stay tuned. I will be back with another video sometime this week. Bye guys.